my name's David Hagen. You know, I was born in Virginia, and I came over here to Scottsdale, Arizona in the second and third grade. So I lived a, a pretty sheltered life uh, because of what I went through. You know, I had something very similar to bipolar, my mother told me. They didn't want to classify it that way because it was more like chemical shifts in my brain according to um, the, my environment. And then I had autism, a learning disability, and hyperactivity symptoms of ADD. I had Asperger's disease and oppositional defiance disorder. And things were really uh, difficult for me to process having all of that. It was uh, how it was like for me when I was going through that. Um, one thing was I would look at people and I'd look them in the eye and it never felt like I was on that level with them. I couldn't connect to them. And it felt like I was on a different planet and I wasn't sure why. I thought it was something I wasn't doing right, something I was doing wrong even. And then when I started this therapy in August of last year, things started to shift for me on, a, on an experiential level in my brain. I didn't change any other, you know, lifestyle habits. I, I did what I was doing, which was seeking to make something of myself given the handicaps I had. And while on this therapy, my reflexes heightened, my focus came back, and I was able to remember things. Like, I remember the stock numbers on cars now out in the lot, and I can bring them back to the computer no problem. Um, that's great short-term memory that I didn't have before. Long-term memory is excellent as well. That's what built me into the uh, conversationalist I am today. And the way I'm wording myself is definitely not how I was able to speak in the past because my brain was, you know, all over the place. It was almost impossible for me to talk in the way I wanted to, to talk to people. When I look at people in the eyes, I'm there with them. And I didn't realize that it was just something misfiring in my brain. I thought I was doing something wrong and now I'm free of that. And it happened instantly in the first three months of the program. It was something truly beautiful. And um, I would recommend anybody watching this video to you know, call regenerative cellular therapy, email them, reach out. If it's not for you, do it for the person in your life that's suffering because it's it's real and it can be resolved and they can be enabled in whatever it is they really want to do with themselves in their life. I'm out to be a great leader for America and then the world and I wouldn't be as developed a leader and as knowledgeable in business as I am today if it weren't for regenerative cellular therapy.